Next, a controversial deal tonight, a plea deal in an officer-involved shooting. A 73-year-old wife and retired librarian was taking part in a community safety workshop in Punta Gorda, Florida. The officer she was working with shot and killed her. He says he did not know his gun had real bullets, and tonight her family shocked to learn that the officer will serve no jail time. Here's ABC's Steve Osinsami. Florida prosecutors have agreed tonight that the former Punta Gorda police officer seen here in street clothes during a community demonstration will serve no jail time for the accidental shooting death of this woman, 73-year-old Mary Knowlton. Her family says it feels like authorities let them down. I don't know. It doesn't seem like we have justice. In 2016, the retired librarian was randomly selected from the crowd for this use of force exercise in the parking lot of the police station, where former police officer Officer Lee Cole was pretending to be the criminal and she the police officer. This is the moment when he fires four shots. They were supposed to be blanks, but they weren't. She died at the hospital. Since the accident, police and the department have been blaming each other for the gun safety mistakes. In court today, Cole had tears in his eyes. He agreed to 10 years of probation, hugged and kissed his wife, and then walked away. Had we got an apology from the police or Lee? That would have made a hell of a big difference in how we felt. A police captain resigned, and the police chief was eventually fired. But a lieutenant who was also caught up in this remains on the force tonight. David. All right, Steve, our thanks to you as well.